share your experiences regarding what's happening with climate change. We see this as an amazing opportunity for you as young professionals to kickstart not a new career, but to kickstart a way to work together. I think this is a very good platform for young guys you know, to understand many things about climate change. I think mean, Ismod has taken a very good step in involving youth, you know, so these guys are a future, you know. There's a lot of things which are going on. The nice reports, but we need action. So this is the point I'm trying to make. We live in an area where local issues are deeply global and global issues profoundly local. So that's why the data is driving all the innovation and technological advancement. It's about me, it's about you, it's about youth who are working on climate change and it's about youth organizations who are working on climate change. You have to put in all the factors that you need to build a start. Many people talk about politics, but I am not going to talk about politics. I want to always consider about the integration between the scientist side and the social side. And the, the, today's presentation, the idea, uh, main suggestions for me about that. It's very interesting and very useful for myself as a journalist because back home I, I do engage and I do work with tons of data. Basically I'm doing research so I think it will be helpful to bring uh, transformation and research culture along Mountie. From the first day, from the lectures, and then, then to the field work uh, on the first day, and then the field work right today. So we are enjoying and learning a lot. Uh, I think it's quite impressive, and uh, you know, I think most of the uh, participant, uh, they didn't uh, experience uh, this kind of field trip, uh, so it's quite good uh, from the local experience. You know, after seeing all of the technologies going around here, and uh, I'm hoping to you know implement those technologies in my country as well.
only when we, we see other aspects uh, or, or what's really going on in other countries then uh, we can go back and uh, really see what, what's going on or how or where we are. The most exciting part is the field visit where like indigenous knowledge are being used for like um, uh, adapting to the effects of the climate change. Um, I, I had a really good experience because I got to meet with a lot of new people. I got to learn a lot of new technologies and adaptation. Also, it was interesting to hear from the different youth and also you get to hear from politicians, the scientists. So it was a whole range of experience. I will spread your message, also this IC mode message to my community also. So, yes. Young ambassadors, this group can go back to your countries, uh, take the messages to your friends, take it to your leaders, and uh, really try to move forward on these issues of climate change and climate adaptation. These decisions are important, right? What decisions we make today uh, will affect your future and the future of your children as well.